Pierre, looking ahead to Saturday's game against Arbroath, what's the plans over the next few days to get the boys ready for another tough away trip? Well, as you know, uh, all the games Jordan are tough in this league and going to Arbroath, you know, everything the, the team are playing against, who obviously have done very well, exceptional this season. So, you know what they give every single match they play, they fight, they're determined, they've got quality, I think, as well, that people tend to forget at times. Uh, so we know it's a very, very tough game, but I keep saying it, I know I've got players that can win matches in the respect of with their talent, you know, but you've got to match all the other things that go with that. How, how much do you hurt not to concede and move up that pitch at important times? We spoke about the, other, the game the other evening there. So you know you have to do that against the broth. You have to be willing to stand tall. And we'll just see, we've got a couple of knocks, unfortunately. You know, so we'll just have a look at them over the next few days and see where everybody is by then. But hopefully, and as I say, this group has been determined to be, make themselves available. But as I say, we've got a couple that maybe be struggling, so we'll just have a look at that over, as I say, the next few days. You know the quality that our both have from the start to the season that they've made, and Tuesday's result away win against Inverness just shows you that the quality that they've got in their ranks. Yes, yeah, so they're a very strong outfit. They're very determined. They know all know their jobs. They work really hard when they've not got the ball. They've got talented boys with possession of the ball. I think people don't realise that, you know, they think our broth, our broth, and oh, wow, they get doing so well. I think people don't obviously watch them playing, and they've been a strong outfit for it for a few years now. So we know how tough it's going to be, we know how tough it was here. We had chances here, obviously, we didn't start the game particularly well. Um, we made an error, and then all of a sudden the game sort of folded for a period of time. But as I say, I know we've got talented boys who are hurting, you know, so <laughs> we've got to make sure we've got to go and show that determination. And, You've got to do that every game in this league. You know, you've got to hurt to win, as I said. And as I say, I know the boys were hurting the other evening there. Now we've got to make up for that and hopefully we can go in there and get our first win. We were hoping that was going to be on Tuesday evening. But now we move on to the next game and hopefully we can put that victory on the board. And the fans on Tuesday night were turned out in great numbers again and made a great atmosphere. You'll be hoping for somewhere on Saturday. Yeah, I'm so disappointed. I know what it means to the supporters and, as I say, I'm gutted for everyone, you know, connected with the club because we had it in the palm of our hand and we gave it away, you know, it was a real disappointment that, you know, because they put so much into the game, put so much effort into the game, and it was just that final moment we, we didn't do that, show that aggressiveness to make sure it stayed three points um, so that was a disappointment but the supporters were excellent and I know how much the boys appreciate that and as I say, I, I, I know they're desperate for I know they're desperate to win games of football and we're desperate to do that for them, we work exceptionally hard to try and do that for them because as I say, I've been here many, many times and seen the support and as I say, I was hoping tonight was going to, uh, Tuesday night was going to be that first victory.